We felt there's kind of a need for something really cool and funny. Um, I mean, there's like tons of stuff out there for DOPs, for cameras, but we felt like we really want to support all those people out there that really care for setting everything in the right light. We'd like to show the possibilities, what the sky panel can do from classical light to cool and warm light to vibrant colors, step by step. The film is getting up to music video style. One of the biggest challenges was the timeline. So we only had four weeks from the idea up to the, the shooting days. Wie ich die Stückzahl hörte so am Anfang beim Vorgespräch und ich hieß so, ich hätte wie 300 Sky Panels, da dachte ich mir, das muss ein Versprecher gewesen sein. Also wir haben jetzt im Set selber 241 S60 Sky Panel verbaut. Das hat bedeutet, jede einzelne Leuchte braucht einen DMX-Anschluss, braucht einen Power-Anschluss und musste natürlich auch in dieser geometrischen Akkuratesse verbaut werden. We're shooting something that has a lot of freedom in terms of creativity and so this cube allows us to play around with a lot of different settings. So whether it be having color chases over the front of the sky panels or whether it be uh, bright flashes and quick movement that the dancers are in a way interacting with the light. We thought we need the right person to control all of that and to get all the ideas from the creative people onto the programming. And that is uh, actually Scott Barnes. We're using the cube as uh, performance lighting as well as cinema lighting. You can set that white light that you like and then you have the parameter that allows you to shift into a more uh, party color control where you can control either the hue saturation or you can control the red, blue, green, and white individual LEDs. And the ability to shift between those two is, is, a, is a key factor in, the, in controlling the light. And they're so even, and they even work in really pale colors, cosmetic gels, and um, just nuances of colors. You know, they're, they're just really, really well, well engineered and uh, great quality as well. You know, and they're super strong. I mean, when Scott was pumping up the signal, we were like, "Whoa!" I'm gonna put this in my house. Wow! So it's got some moment where I'm about to stay and get scans out. For anyone who's never used the sky panel, I think it'll only take one time for them to realize that there's no other reason why you shouldn't use a sky panel. For this kind of project, I think the only lighting unit is the sky panel. They were used on major feature films, such as uh, Star Wars, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, and also in theaters around the world, and uh, broadcast stations. So it's, it's really crossing over several areas where we even didn't intend to place the product, and people just love it, and they use it everywhere. Aerie is actually turning 100 years old, uh, but even though we're a very old company, we still have a lot of new innovation, and the sky panel is a perfect example of that. We're still pushing the boundaries of lighting technology even today. So enjoy it, feel the vibe. It's Aerie Lighting.